Ruth here, and this is the opening of the awesome Premium Trainers XY Collection. As you see, it won't even fit on the screen. I even had to put my tripod to uh, extend it up a bit, otherwise I wouldn't be able to uh, even put this much on the screen. So, as you see on the very top, it has Premium Trainers Collection. The XY collection. On the back, I can twirl it without hitting the camera. You see, it has like the X and the Y design, which is awesome. Like, and the info instead of on the back is actually on the bottom part here. So, like it shows everything you'd get inside in like picture, like what um, the uh, collection kind of boxes do for Japan. So, let's see if I can read this. Live large with a giant collection of premium cards with more than a dozen full art promo cards and an amazing assembly of accessories. The Premium Trainers XY collection stands out as a player's paradise. Powerful, tournament worthy Pokemon EX and trainer cards combine with a metal Pikachu coin and booster packs from the XY series to make the Premium Trainers collection, the XY collection, an unbelievable upgrade to anyone's collection. So you see, it also says on like the contents bit, full art promo cards featuring Shaman EX, Seville EX with special art treatments, 12 more full art promos, including Aegis Slash EX, Jirachi, N, and more, two Pokemon TCG booster packs from the XY series, I don't know why they even bothered putting them in there, really, because, yeah. Um, a metal coin featuring Pikachu head and a tail for, you know, heads and tails. Two sets of uh, 65 card sleeves featuring Xerneas and Eveltal, each. Double deck box featuring Xer Xerneas and Eveltal, obviously, because they're the legendaries for XY series. Two sets of tournament ready dice, a code card for the Pokemon trading card game online, which you get like all of this stuff, uh, except for the booster packs, I think. You get the full arts, the deck box, maybe the dice, and I think coin and slaves. I'm not really sure. And a large kickstand style box to hold it all. So, yeah. And I did kind of cheat by watching other people open this, like, um, who else opened this? Um. Pokemon Life Retro New. Um, who else opened it? Oh, I can't remember right now. So, let's do this very carefully so I don't, you know, damage anything. Because obviously I don't want to damage anything. <laughs> I mean, this was like. I think when I bought it, it was about 71. 72, but right now it's up a bit on the, at 73.95. But since the retail price is like 94.99, it is very good. The cast cards, I don't think ever really sells anything at retail price. It's always a good discounted price. So, ooh, oh, now that I got the cardboard bit off, the top, as you see, is like, you know, red, and the bottom here is blue. Well, I'm super exerting any belt all colors. So let's put this in the trash, because I seemingly have it right next to me. And like, this is awesome. So I think it's, it's got like a, uh, easy slot there to get it out like. So that's good, I can stick that in my, uh, what's it called, uh, scrapbook for other 
box art stuff because obviously I can't cut this box because if you listen, oh, if you can listen though, it's magnetic. It's awesome. I love magnetic things. Well, I can just sit there playing with it all day, really. Of course, you didn't come watch the video just for me playing with the magnetic uh, release thing. So, if you see, there are actually. Well, if you want to see anyway, there are actually two circular strong magnetic bits here and over here. And hey, you kind of see me there. Anyway, let's move on to the awesome epicness of this epic awesomeness. And it's this very hard, uh, heavy cardboard. Um, is it? This bit. Yeah. So it can just pop right out. How about, look at that. How about that? Alright. Which is nice. It's just popping out. Because, like, then I don't have to. That's not damage anything. This thing will click back in place. Okay, good plastic. And what's that? The other one is still down there. All right. Okay. So we have the awesome Shaman EX with a Mega Rayquaza at the back there with the ability set up and attack 30 damage Sky Return. Obviously, as you see, it has A for alternate art. It looks more like a secret rare than I don't know. I don't know if that's like the point, but uh. For this, we'll get the shiny sleeves I had ready. Though, for extra added protection, things falling in the background. I'll just lay it like that. Okay, we've always got like the shiny, shiny sleeves. So, we'll also put it in a cam so you fit because. I just not have them this damaged. <laughs> so, see it slides in with perfect fit. Then we got a in here for double protection. And so shiny. Awesome. So, so far we'll just put it right there for now. So we got the next one is Eveltal EX. I would have preferred Xerneas because I like Xerneas better than Eveltal, but that's just me. Though I've heard, um, let's see, Pokemon Evolutionaries refer to Eveltal as a strip of bacon, which I can actually see because it does kind of look like bacon, you know, if you really char it. Like, I don't really like my bacon that crispy though. But uh, this one has a sort of secret-ish kind of vibe, secret, secret rare-ish kind of vibe going with the gold background there. Borders, I mean, can't speak. Anyway, this has a uh, evil ball and Y cyclone. Okay. So put it in its own shiny sleeve, for, and it's also got the alternate art. Oh yes, I didn't say that this one. And this one is alternate art from a set. This one says alternate art and it says Blackstar Promo XY 150A. Here we have a very nicely sort of trainer full art, which is Team Flare Grunt. Awesomeness. And this is from 
what was that generation set? Set symbol is it? I don't know, it's got lines and a plus and stuff. Anyway, it's a um, 73A slash 83. And it's alternate art, obviously. And this one has... Uh, discard an energy attached to your po opponent's active Pokemon. Well, that's, you know, like a, a bad guy thing to do, I guess. So that's... it relates. There, very nice. Then we have the awesome and it's just awesome. This one is from was it Fates Collide? Is it or something? Well, it's got that starish kind of symbol there. It says card 105 A out of 124. Oh, she's got the A in this corner for alternate art. This is like... Come to the dark side. Or, you know. It's one of those type of poster things. keep all my, you know, Elite Trainer Box sleeves for these awesome cards because I like the shininess on the back of them. So these are from the first uh, cover page a bit, I guess. First plastic round. So the next round of plastic. Um, where should I put these? Oh, I don't know. I'll just put them here for now. So the next round of plastic. Um, I guess I have to take off plastic. Yeah. Okay, so I need to move these. Okay, I'll just put that there for now. to damage anything. Okay, so this plastic bit can be put to the side for recycling after. Okay, so the first thing that kind of popped up, we have a camera, mega camera up to EX. Mint condition. With a magma eruption, 120 plus damage. I discard in and energies and whatnot. So, to be honest, I don't really like this Pokemon very much, but there we go. And this is like a promo XY198A and an A for alternate art in the corner there. Got a very big hairdo. Let me just, I guess, put that there for now. Because I have nowhere else to put them at the moment. So I'll just put them in between the plastic. And they'll, they'll stay straight if I put them there anyway. Okay, so we have a Mega Sharpedo EX. And I've got a normal Sharpedo, I just don't have a Mega one yet anyway. So that's good. And this says, what's it says? A torpedo dive for 120 damage. Cool. Promo XY200A with alternate art, obviously. And I think everything in this box is alternate art, I believe. By the looks of things, it is. So, I won't bother saying alternate art because that's the whole box. Totally like wasting my breath if I said that every single time. Okay, so here we have a Regirock EX. You know, Regirock 
kind of gets like all the cards really because like I've never seen an EX uh, like well except for the old old ones but like an EX like a proper one like this like the newer version of EX for a Reggie Ice or a Reggie Steel they always got like maybe a reverse holo, a holo possibly or just a normal rare but they never get this I mean do people just not like those two or something anyway this is Reggie power ability with the bedrock press 100 damage and this obviously is in very good apart from maybe a slight whiting on the bottom there but since I did look into you know PSA stuff but it's too, uh, they don't have PSA things in the UK only in uh, US so it's a bit of a expensive to actually do that so I think I won't bother with that I'll just keep them in good condition okay so here we have a Aegis Aegis uh, it's a sword and shield basically with a very creepy eye right there X no no it's not a promo it's a 65A from uh, whatever the uh, set that was, I can't remember. With a mighty shield for an ability and a slash blast for uh, 40 plus damage for the attack. They don't really have very many uh, metal uh, type Pokemon variant cards anyway. Very. Aegis slash? He just yeah anyway pronunciation not the best at this time of the day and so we have here the only non-textured full art I mean why I mean it's a it's it's a, it's a it's a blooming legendary and they don't even texture the thing I mean, what's up with that Anyway, Jirachi seems happy with it, so here we have Promo XY 67A with Stardust and Dream Dance for attacks. He looks very happy, and I'm so glad this little eye is closed because that is just creepy. For the last part of this plastic bit, we have the metal Pikachu coin. What do you do? Hey, it is very nicely made. Okay, you don't really feel the uh, layers, but you can if you press your finger on it, you can feel like the separate bits because like it's got a layer of like glossed over layer over it. Then we have the tail, and as you can tell, it's. It's a male one because there's no like heart indent top, you know. Cause that's the female ones, and it is metal, I believe. Yeah, so that's awesome. That you're awesome with the rest of the coins. So since it is a metal coin, I might put it with the actual coin collection I do have instead of the Pokemon coin collection, but my actual coin coin collection. I don't know. Because right now the only other coins collection thing I do have is uh, this is just, you know, stuck on, you know, just in a little box, so be more protection if I did it the other way. Anyway, here is the next bits. As you can see, they actually managed to layer this one very nicely with uh, all the uh, Y's and the X's in the right place. And uh, let's see, I'll just leave that there for now. So here we have the awesome blacksmith supporter card with 
full art, obviously. Everything is full art in this thing. This is 88A out of 106 with like that antler kind of symbol. I can't remember the uh, set, but there we go. As uh, embargo, embor, or em, em, the evolution of the of tepig, you know, the fire pig thing. Anyway, so they're holding lumps of coal for some reason, or whatever they're holding. So that is awesome. Then we have Shauna, so like a little determined face there. Holding a Pokeball with her little pink bag with the bow on it. Well, shoulder bag, as most of them have these days. Very decent heels there, too. Anyway, just... Yep. Shuffle your hand into your deck and draw five cards. This is what her um, ability thing is. Card effect. Oh, what she does. So, yeah, that's very nice. Now down here, we have Delinquent Trainer Support. So are obviously with a uh, Minin down there and a uh, Mightyena as her Pokemon. It is pretty awesome. And this one is a 98B out of 122. And man, or is this one the? F this one's not the Fates Collide symbol, but like the circle with like the three pronged like star-ish thing coming from the bottom. My set symbols. My ass. I'm I'm very bad at remembering what sets or what. But there we go. No one cares about the set because it isn't really in the set because it's an alternate art. So there we go. There we have it. Okay, now we've got Karen, which I, th I think I've seen this one in the uh, uh, Japanese opening I saw on YouTube somewhere. Most likely Pokemon Evolutionaries or something. Open that one. So I don't know if they actually made this in English. So this is X-Ray 177A promo. Eh. That's pretty cool anyway. Anyway, so the last card anyway. We have the Hex Maniac supporter. And this is a 75A out of 98, and I have no idea what that spirally thing is. So I won't even try and guess. Let's see, what does she do? She is totally creepy looking in a very uh, interesting way, I guess. And well, she's got like loads of like little eyes in the background. So until the end of your opponent's next turn, each Pokemon in play, in each player's hand, and in each player's discard pile has no abilities. This includes cards that come into play on that turn. So like this is like a basically like a disable attack sort of thing. That like drowsy or hypno -hana. So I might as well just briefly show. This is the uh, tournament, um, you know, transparent, translucent, or whatever. If you really want to, you know, compare, it is. This is obviously more opaque than that one. It's even dice. Okay, so. I'll have to find somewhere to put that dice later. 
And the last plastic bit, which I don't know if I'll open this because I don't actually really need to. The only thing in here are the two deck boxes that have art of this and this, and two deck dividers which have an art of this and an art of this, and a um, magnetic sheet that says my name is blah, you know. So this is what the deck, double deck box looks like. So I don't really need this now, so I'll leave it sealed. Here, obviously, we have the shiny shiny. Yvaltal and Xerneas uh, sleeve, card leaf, yes, that, that's it. So I'll be taking those. Actually, pull out. Whoops. I don't have anywhere else to put them at the moment, so let's just put them down here. Ooh, notice the blue goes with my blue sheep. There we go, we can just fit that in there. I'll put this somewhere else later. So I can throw the plasticky bits away. Well, not throw them, you know, recycle them. That's a very lot of, lot of plastic, so I'll just put that there for now. And it comes with, for some inane reason, two packs. So, Rowing Skies and Prong Clash. It also comes with a code card as well. As I said before. But yeah, so I'll just leave that there for now. Let's open these, because it's the last thing to open. Let's hope we get a good pack. Good stuff, anyway. So... Most might as well. Okay, so you've got at least a code in this anyway. <laughs> I'm almost done for. Okay, we've got a special energy, so double dragon energy, which I don't think I have this one out of all of my energy collection bits I've got. Minetric. Trainer's Mail. Inkay. Pikachu. Barnacle. Wingle. Spira, Reverse Tranquil, and a Bayonet. Bayonet. Oh, it's a creepy ghost thing. That normally flies on a broom. So, for promo class. Okay, we got a Double Blade, which I don't know if I have that one, so that's good. We have teammates, which I don't think I have that anyway. <laughs> Freshwater set, Smooth Sagoon, Tynamo, Nidoran uh, Female, Tentacool, Torchic, a Silent Lab Reverse, which I don't believe I have a reverse of anyway, and where is a Starmie? Where? Not hollow. So that was a dead pack. But uh, all in all, this was pretty good. So I got, you know, a couple ones I didn't have anyway. So that's always good. So have you noticed? The uh, it is slightly, I don't think the, the cut is slightly larger on one. Yeah, anyway, it doesn't really matter. So, that is everything. So all of the awesome you know, full art. So here you go. Here's, you know, basic view of all of them. I, I really like the end one, though. Because it's very pretty. And just, it looks cool like that, too. That pose. How do you anyway, I'm, I'm restuffing the premium trainers XY collection box with my sleeves so I can have them all in one place instead of in multiple Elite Trainer boxes. So I figured, also, since I might as well open this because I need somewhere to put the dice. So, um, yeah. I'll just open that. Because, like, why not? That's okay. Let's 
some reason, it's got tape on both sides. I see that. So, hope you don't like it. Okay, it's fit packed. And wow, that feels so glossy. And as you know, ah, okay. So that, and as I said before, it's uh, hello, my name is Magma Bit there. Here we have three one with Xerneas, one with Valentine, and one with both. It's very uh, plastic, plasticky, silky feeling. There. In each box, as I said before, you got an Viltal and an Xerneas. So that is what it looks like when you take it out. Okay. So it's very uh, plasticky, or is it plastic or acrylic or a type of. It's it's thick, thick stuff. So I thought I might as well, you know, put my dice in there because I can't be bothered to find anywhere else to put them. So we'll put So, thank you for watching. Like subscribe for more. Over and out.